वेलकम बैक फ्रेंड्स टू द फ्री ऑटोमेशन लर्निंग एंड माई सर चिराग सो टूडे गाइज वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस सिलीनियम वेब ड्राइवर विद क्रोम सो हाउ वी कैन रन आर टेस्ट स्क्रिप्ट ऑन वन ऑफ फेमस ब्राउजर विच इज नोन एज अ क्रोम सो फर्स्टली वी हैव टू रन आर टेस्ट स्क्रिप्ट ऑन क्रोन क्रोम वी नीड टू डाउनलोड अ क्रोम ड्राइवर फ्रॉम अ सिलीनियम डाउनलोड वेबसाइट सो दिस क्रोम ड्राइवर इज नॉट क्रिएटेड और डिजाइन बाय द सिलीनियम गाइज इट इज डिजाइन बाय अ थर्ड थर्ड पार्टी राइट सो वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट डाउनलोड हाउ वी कैन डाउनलोड क्रोम ड्राइवर हाउ वी कैन सेट अप क्रोम ड्राइवर ऑन आर मशीन इन वर्क क्रोम ड्राइवर एंड रन आर टेस्ट स्क्रिप्ट ऑन क्रोम ब्राउजर राइट सो लेट मी स्टार्ट विद हाउ वी कैन डाउनलोड क्रोम ड्राइवर सो फर्स्ट वी वी इन ओपन एनी ब्राउजर एंटर गूगल डॉट कॉम राइट सिलीनियम डाउनलोड दिस इज अलीनियम वेबसाइट सिलीनियम वेब ड्राइवर गो टू आर डाउनलोड here you can see a chrome driver this is a google chrome driver from here we can and download and this is a third party browser driver do not develop by selenium hq so this is our the chrome driver so now uh, click on this and you shortly see that it will start downloading right so i on already download this chrome driver uh just this is the latest chrome driver so here you can download from which you want for this um, uh, window machine we can download this and for mac machine if you are using mac machine you can download this click on this Will start downloading. So, uh, so just it's give me a second, right? So it has been downloaded. Now I will open. So here this is uh, my Chrome driver. I just go. Let's. extract it and this is a my chrome driver right so i am going to with my eclipse and i am going to create a new folder for driver just go and new and folder i'm creating a new folder driver now i just go and copy this driver and paste to my new folder so you can see this chrome driver is downloaded so now i'm going to create a new test script and to show how we can use this chrome driver to invoke chrome browser right so this is my tutorial and always as i do declare web driver here for this uh, for uh, this uh, chrome driver we have to give the this uh, chrome driver dot exe to our web, uh, test scripts where we have put this chrome driver so just i'm going to give path so i'm create a new uh, variable string variable path and this is our system class get property this is uh, the uh, java code and i will write 
user dir so it will give me path of the my current directory so let what would be the result so it is give me the path of this in this my uh, this uh, this framework or this code is uh, put in this directory so just now i am have to set a path so guys what is a chrome driver dot exe basically it is a uh, server and uh, uh, when we invoke um, our chrome driver uh, then this uh, chrome browser is open by this server and the communi uh, communicate with our test scripts so this is a chrome driver dot exe right now just first we have to set path driver this is our key and value will be the this uh, where we have put chrome driver dot exe going to invoke chrome driver here just leave it and new now i am going to chrome driver dot manage to maximize window I'm going to set implicit width for here for 30 second. I already discussed what is implicit width, guys. If you do not watch my video for implicit width, please go and watch video. Now I'm going to. So this is the how we set up Chrome driver. Set up Chrome driver on machine. Now public void test.
later and i am going to click on gmail driver dot find element by dot link test gmail dot click now again i will print title of the page right so this is would be my test script i am just going to call the method of test google so guys this is the code in a uh, uh, chrome driver right and here we just navigate to google.com and here we just driver dot get title means uh, uh, we get a title of the current page then we click on this uh, gmail link and then again we just uh, get the title of the current page now i'm going to run this test script so soon this chrome driver will open you see the chrome driver will open now it's maximize now it's go to the google.com now it click on this and this would be my test if you see first it open google then click on gmail let me maximize this first it will open google then it will open gmail so guys this is only the log it is not a error it is a log it just say that our local connection are allowed and my uh, chrome browser will open so guys this is for this video if you like this video please click on like button and as always i am going to upload my code into github you can download this code and you can easily use this code into your machine so thank you for watching this